dear student data buses are not like the uh, transport buses but works actually uh, works, works accordingly the uh, how the transport buses works you know that the transport buses pick up the passengers from different kind of stations and they unload these passengers from on different kind of uh, different um, uh, stations at the same time these data buses or the digital buses works on this principle they connect they connect different kind of equipment they connect different LRUs uh, with the another LRU but the data traveling on these data traveling on these buses is very fast and they in they share the data with the uh, other equipment and they uh, they interconnect the data with the different kind of equipments so that on different places that data can be displayed and uh, by using this uh, technology we can minimize the weight of an aircraft we can uh, we can have a, a quick f uh, format of data traveling and there is a uh, lots and lots of kind of benefits which are attached to this databases so let's start our first uh, is the information these are the data buses of different examples the bus used in the computers these are the buses used in the computers and what is a data bus a system for trans transferring data. a very very simple kind of uh, definition is for data buses that this is a mode of traveling data and that data can be electrical or the optical electrical means then that could be an electrical signal that could be an optical signal and that data can be or that the the, the network of these data buses could be series or parallel in the series you would have a just a single wire usage but the data speed would be very less that would be a sp small speed but at the when you are traveling when you having the parallel kind of uh, networking that could be a very fast and but that could be some costly because you have to use two pair of the uh, two pairs of the cable no RNA RNA 4 to 9 RNA 3 to 6 etc these RNA stands for the aeronautical radio incorporated are earning established in 1929 is a major provider of transport communication and standards means to say that the aeronautical aeronautical radio incorporated or RNIC is a corporation which provides the these these cables are the communication standards for transporting different kind of the data these students are 4 to 9 is a commercial uh, commercial uh, data traveling cable which is used on the commercial aircrafts in a vast uh, quantity so we need to study about this aronic 4 to 9 aronic 4 to 9 is a serial data bus flows in only one direction information is 32 bit long speed is uh, data speed is about at low speed that works on the 12 to the 14 kilobits per second at a high speed 100 kilobits per second that's the very high speed as far as the data traveling is concerned used twisted pair of wires with shielded these are the twisted pairs two pairs but in a twisted uh, configuration and shielded these are having a shield on the twisted pair now how the data travels how the data travels this is a this is a string of a data here you can see that the 10 volt high and the 10 volt low and the 0 volt null this is the reference point and this is a high bit this is a low bit means to say this is a logic 1 this is logic 0 and how this data string is constructed how is data a data word is constructed basically a data word is constructed four bit intervals here we are having a four bit of interval why this intervals occurs we will study it later on 
data world construction first you need to have this thing that a data world is 32 bit from 1 to the 32 bit now these 32 bits are being divided into different portions these portions uh, provides a distinct kind of information which is which is contained in this data world which is contained in this data world the first eight bits the first eight bits are called the label first eight bit is called the label which identifies what the information is for example that could be temperature what that could be the height that could be uh, anything which is uh, which could be used in a uh, uh, electronic configuration these two bits 9 and the 10 bits is the source ident destination identifier from where this data is coming whether this data is coming from the HSI whether th this data is for the and where it has to go whether it has to go for the primary PFD um, 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 means to the say that the that MFD is for the other MFD is for that uh, source source and the destination is there this is the this is the information of destination and f here to here actually this is the digital data world which contains the data means to say that is the basically a data information and this information is in binary conditions and here sign status matrix gives the data information a characteristic that is positive or negative and the at end the bit number 32 is parity bit which provides the information to the system that whether the complete string of this data is in which state means to say it's false or true means to say this parity bit gives a test report that either it has reached on its destination or not so with this I have give you a good information about the data word now what is parity parity is a, a bit number 32 is for parity and the Renick 429 uses the odd parity sum of all logic one in the word should create odd number bit 32 is used to ensure this means to say this is a surety kind of bit which could gives you a surety that the data which is which you are traveling the data which is contained in this data bit data data word that is uh, transmitted or received in accurate way so this is a test and which is being ensured due to this parity bit Aaronic 4 Aaronic, uh, after the Aaronic 4 to 9 we are having different uh, other modules of the Aaronic series that is Aaronic 6 to 9 as well and this is a very high speed kind of uh, data cable which is being used uh, in aircraft uh, construction and the data rate of Aaronic 6 to 9 is 2 megahertz and that was mu much high as compared to the Aaronic 4 to 9 that was having the high rate of uh, that is having the high rate of almost uh, 100 kilobyte kilobits the data is a two way in this Aaronic 6 to 9 multi terminals means to say you can use up to the 120 terminals means to say that you can attach the 122 LRUs with this uh, Aaronic 6 to 9 the length could be approximately up to the 100 meter length of twisted pair this is of twisted pair nature no shielding for a hundred uh, meter you could not use with the shielding pair this is another example here in this example you could you are you can see that this is a flight recorder is attached with the cable this is called the stub 
this is called the terminator and these are the LRUs which are being attached with the main cable main cable these are the stub cables stub means that these are the joining parts with the main cable bus couplers these bus couplers are being are the joints which are being used to join the different kind of equipment with an aircraft stub cables these this uh, they, uh, the, these stub cables means to say these stubs connect uh, the couplers to the equipment equipment to the connect the couplers to the equipment they consist of two pairs of twisted pair twisted pair cables one for transmit and one for receive the stub cable has a shield the stub cable has a shield so here is a complete information related to this data cable this is a main string that is called the da data bus terminator data bus terminator and you are having a joining couplers these are the couplers this is a coupler this is a coupler and this is a coupler but these couple uh, these uh, couplers are joined with the LRUs joined with the LRUs with the help of stub cables these are called the stub cables this is a stub cable this is a stub cable this is a stub I hope this would give you a good idea about the uh, complete network of data bus Aronix 629 data structure each each message made of word string is maximum of 31 bits and the word string label followed by up to 256 data words each label or data word is 20 bit long with this thank you very much for watching this video i hope that you have liked uh, you have get a uh, good information about the data bus buses and especially data bus of uh, RNIC 429 and the RNIC 629. Thank you very much again and uh, uh, share your ideas and comment on uh, our videos for, the, uh, for improving ourselves. Thank you very much and keep watching this uh, our video series. Thank you very much.